Good morning, Cougars. This is Mr. Martinez with the morning announcements. Good morning, Joya. Good morning, Mr. Martinez. Good morning, Luca. Good morning, everybody. Good morning, Luca. It's Friday. We love Fridays, uh, especially a Friday before a three-day weekend. Remember, no school on Monday. It's President's Day, so we are super excited. Guys, we have a flag today that's appropriate for Valentine's Day that is Sunday. Check out this flag. Wow, it's made of fruits and a heart. That's so cool. Yeah, it's in a heart shape. I love it. This is from Julie in the fourth grade. Sent that in to us. It's appropriate for Valentine's Day. I love how creative she was. Thank you, Julie. Uh, Joy, lead us in our Pledge of Allegiance. Place your right hand over your heart and begin. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible with liberty and justice for all. All right. Again, big shout out to uh, Julie in the fourth grade. Thank you for sending us that in. Uh, good morning, everybody. Very happy Friday. Today is February 12th, 2021. At my house, I don't know about yours right now, but it's raining and it's foggy outside, but it's not going to last long. There's him by, by noon today, actually noon when we have our dance party it should be a, a sunny, maybe a little cloudy, but it's going to be warm in the upper 60s today. Uh, guys, we forgot something major joy yesterday. Do you know what, what day of the year it was yesterday at school? The 100th day of school. How did we forget that? I don't know. We totally missed that. I don't even know. Uh, and the only way that I know is that I did get some pictures uh, that I want to share. Uh, our primary grades for the 100th day do a nice celebration where they dress up like 100-year-old uh, men and women. And here's a picture of our first grade teachers. Joy, who is that? Oh yeah, that? Look at these first oh grade teachers. The, oh how, these little grandmas, we didn't know we had grandmas teaching first grade, did we, Luca? No, I, I, I definitely didn't. No, so they uh, got in the spirit yesterday for the 100th day, dressed up like year 100 year old uh, teachers. And even our students, this is a picture of Bellamy in the kindergarten. She got dressed up like a little grandma yesterday to celebrate. So big shout out to our primary grades. I know Zero the Hero made a virtual appearance for kindergarten yesterday also. Uh, so, so sorry that we missed. Today is day 101, right? Remember there are 180 Woo. school days in a year. We are now at 101. Uh, we're also this week celebrating Student Council Spirit Week. Joy, what's today? What's the focus? Today is Valentine Grammys in your jammies. Hey, and is that the reason why we're wearing our jammies? Let's see your jammies there. Joy, you got your top on? Let's see. Okay, you've got your jammies on. Luca? Yep. Nice jammies. You can see I've got my jammies. I've got my, my eye cover for what, when I sleep, and I always sleep in my, my cougar beanie to keep my ears warm when I'm asleep. Uh, so we are celebrating Grammys in your jammies day. And what do we want people to do during the school day, Joy? We want you to write a message in the chat to, or like a compliment to your teacher, friend, or parent professional. Absolutely. Now on this parent Zoom recording, we can't show the chat. I was going to show you, I was going to send you guys a chat, but I wrote out a Valentine gram for each of you. Joya, here's, here is your Valentine gram for me. It says, thank you for waking up early every morning, Joya. Happy Valentine's Day. Thank you so much. No problem. <laughs> And Luca, I've got a Valentine gram for you also, my friend. Oh. I really love Luca's laudable laughs, buddy. So happy Valentine's Day. Oh, uh, thank you. Can you two think of some people you're going to send some uh, some Valentine gram chats to? Yeah. Um, got them in your head? Maybe my brother. Okay. Oh, very nice. Yeah. Oh, and remember, in, in your class, too, you can send it to one of your classmates oh. or one of the paraprofessionals. Even your teacher, Mrs. Greenlee. I bet she'd love to get a little Valentine Graham chat as well. Yep. Today is also the Chinese Lunar New Year. Uh, and if I'm going to pronounce this correctly, Joy, you want to say it for us? How do we say that? Uh, what do we say for a Chinese Lunar New Year? I think it's Gong He Fa Choi, but oh, I don't okay. think I'm pronouncing it quite Well, perfectly. what that but translates I'm trying. To, Yeah, we're trying. Gong He Fa Choi. I it actually it means, it doesn't mean Happy New Year like most people think. It actually means wishing you great happiness and prosperity. 
So big shout out to everybody celebrating Chinese Lunar New Year all over the world uh, today. Uh, it's Friday. We always share Luca's laudable laughs on Fridays. Uh, Luca, go ahead and take over that screen and uh, show us what you got submitted this week. Yep. Okay, so... To this week, um, the we asked you guys to submit your a suggestion for the dance party today. Because, you know, we're going to have an all fifth grade dance party, then an all grade dance party later today, actually. Oh, yeah. And, um, well, you see the submissions. Oh, As you can see, Devin right here. Dancing see? in Heaven. I've never heard of that song. Okay, by Q Feel. It's an orbital bebop. Okay, all right. Taking a note I've of never that. heard of this song either, but I like the cover. Yeah, the it's cover great. Right there. You, That's really cool. Very good. Okay. Here's our boy Isaiah. Isaiah said to something. Well, let's see what it is. He says that my favorite music suggestion is Feel This Moment. And that looks like that's Christina Aguilera and um, Pitbull. Okay. Thank you, Isaiah. Now, Hava says that her music suggestion oh, is, well, I'll just let Joya say it. <laughs> Mamma Mia, here we go again. <laughs> Mamma Mia. All right. Okay, Hava. We all love the Mamma Mia. We were going to throw a little bit of that in there. Okay. And, well, Spencer, he, he um, uh-oh, where'd he go? Oh, no. Yeah, he came back. He has, he has four suggestions. He says that he wants to listen to Sunflower from Spider-Man into the Spider-Verse. That was our movie night once, I think. Yes. Yeah. Ready, Jet, uh, go, and for two says, Ready, Jet, Go, theme song, Upside Down, Inside Out by OK Go, and Solar System Songs by Kids Learning Tube. I love that Spencer put the heart in the background there, too. Mm -hmm. Nice job, Spence. Now, as you can see, Theo right here is scrolling through. And he's got that highlighted Sunday yeah, and he, best. His we cursor all is on this song. one right here. All right. Okay. Gotcha. We got you, Theo. And Christian sent over this video. It doesn't actually have audio, so I didn't share the screen. Okay, but the song is Marshmallow. Okay. Yeah, very. it's just a video of him showing the whiteboard. Okay. All right. Very good. Thank and you, um, let's go back in. That's all, folks. All right, guys. I've got a mental note of those songs. Thank you, everybody that submitted those. Uh, we do want to remind everybody that we're celebrating Black History Month. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, and so for Black History Month today, we're going to highlight a movie. And Luke, I know I went out of order a little bit, but what, let's do this now. Uh, this is the movie we're highlighting for Black History Month. It's called The Main Event. Tell everybody about The Main Event. So The Main Event is a movie. Um, hold on. Hold on just a second. So this movie, The Main Event, is about um, this guy who uses special powers from like a magical mask. A young a WWE fan causes chaos when he enters into a wrestling competition and he fights an intimidating rival. Very good. And you can stream that on Netflix. It's called The Main Event. Great movie. Great message in there also. Uh, we want to spotlight that today. Uh, guys, every Friday we do a Unity Fair family video. And in honor of the Chinese Lunar New Year, we have a new video uh, that teaches everybody how to make something delicious. Watch this. Oh, you know what? I don't think I did my audio. Let me make sure my audio is set. It is now. And here we go. Hi. Hi. Um, we are making Lunar New Year dumplings. Homemade. And we're going to do them vegetarian style, so no meat. Okay, 
We're going to show you the ingredients. So these now. are all the ingredients. This is um, green cabbage, the dumpling wrap, the dumpling dough wrap things, uh, the fake beef, soy sauce, sesame oil, and mushroom and green onion mixed together. So now and we're adding the spices, oil, and spices. Spices. Okay. Um. Yum, yum, yum. I can't wait for this future. What okay. you putting in, Ward? The salt and the pepper. Okay, go ahead. That's good. Now we're actually getting to the dumpling making process. Okay. So first we put all the mixture into the dumpling wrap. As you can you don't want to make it too big. Then you put take water, the water on it to seal it in. Yeah, on the sides. Which See, like basically makes it dumps. a dumpling. It's kind of like clay that way. It's basically a glue. Mm -hmm. You got to be real careful not to have any of the filling get yes. out. Because that would be gross. Because then it wouldn't be a dumpling. And yeah, you just squeeze it closed. And you have a dumpling. Yeah. As you can see, she made a test one already. Ta -da. So, okay, Mom is doing a different method. Let's see how she goes. Oh, what are you doing, Ooh. Mom? It looks fancy. Is that another dumpling for you, Ward? Yep. Okay, let's put it under the nice wet towels so that we can keep them nice and wet and not dry okay, so out. So the dumplings are going are now being cooked. And we put peanut oil. So they're in a nice kind of rose shape. And here's a traditional noodle dish for long life. Noodles are great, auspicious, long life. Long life, that's joy. Yay! Happy Lunar New Year! Nom! Nom, 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 nom. All right, what did you think, guys? I thought that was great, and I love dumplings, and my little sister Maisie is actually vegetarian, so maybe we can make these sometime, and Maisie would be able to eat them. Yeah. Luca, do you like dumplings? Yeah, I, I really like dumplings, and they also confirmed our... They confirmed our way of saying gung hey fat choy. Yes, they the did. Very end. That. Yeah, a very good notice on that. I bet you uh, I could probably eat about 12 of those little dumplings uh, right now. <laughs> so amazing. So great, <laughs> great episode. video this week uh, in celebration of the Lunar New Year uh, for sure. We want to remind everybody two things happening again. We talked about it earlier. Joy, what's happening at 12 o'clock today? We're going to have a fifth grade only dance party with. DJ Valentinez at 12 p.m. to 12.45. And again, when yeah. DJ Valentinez is looking for kids to spotlight, what, what, what will I be looking for? Will I be looking for this, boys and girls? Uh, guys, show me what I will not select anybody to spotlight. What's that look like? Okay, show me what I will be spotlighting. Um, people who are dancing. Yeah, if you're dancing, then I'll be putting the spotlight on you and let you get your groove on for everybody for a few minutes. Uh, after school, Luca, remind everybody what's happening then? Yes, after school, well, the dance parties do not end. We have an all-school dance party with DJ Hong and MCL from 2.15 to 2.45. Right. 
And I'm bringing uh -huh. our geese back up on the screen and let's do our words of wisdom, guys. Boys and girls, there's still more to learn from the geese that we talked about yesterday. When the lead goose, and if you look out there in the picture, you can see it, when the lead goose gets tired, all that goose does is move to the back and relaxes and lets another goose lead for a while. The Chinese understand this wisdom and they say, no matter how stout, one beam cannot support a house. In other words, no matter how strong one goose cannot be the leader for the entire trip, any more than one beam can hold up an entire house. So if you've been carrying the biggest load, need a rest, remember to ask for help or give somebody else a chance to be a leader. If, on the other hand, you've been following too much and not sharing the work, step forward, be a leader. With something to think about, this is Mr. Martinez. And Jaya. And me, Luca. Make it a, make, uh, make it a great day. Or not. The choice is yours. I want to remind everybody, no school on Monday, President's Day. Sunday's Valentine's Day. We got the two dances today. Guys, have an awesome, awesome Friday, February 12th, okay? Bye. Okay. See you next All right. Tuesday. Remember, send out those Valentine grants.